that little tiny trophy. Holy crap. That ain't small. Little trophy. There's one on the Evo chatterbait.
uh, number three. needed that one. That's, I've caught a bunch of small ones today. That one's a lot better. Catch that one. Chatterbait. That's probably two, two and a half pounds. Yeah. And it might that's be a good a spot to hang. It's like right, right in those shadows, almost in the corner of that dock here. Oh, yeah. I think so, but I'm just fun fishing. Yeah, it's a, not a bad one. Two point eight six. That's almost three pounds. That's two and a half pounds. Yeah. Right on. Um, oh, this goes two. by. Uh, this goes by tens. So oh. it's almost three pounds. Okay. Tens. So, so. Um, she said she got a six and a half pound bass out of here. Uh, last you? spring I caught a seven four. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. That's the biggest one I've caught out of here. I've caught a bunch of fives. Really? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I understand that. Oh, I bet. <laughs> you try to eat it. Come right off the corner of that roof thing they got going on. I don't know what it is, but that's best, by far the best one I've caught today. Yeah, everything I've caught today came off boat lifts. That's why I was like, well, I know there's a whole bunch back in here. So <laughs> there's another example of it. What's going on, everyone? We're just hanging out here at the lake. Um, it is the next day after our fishing adventure at Seneca. And I just wanted to kind of recap how the day went. Overall, it was a pretty good morning. I, th I think I got on the water around 6.30 and ended up pulling the boat out around noon, 1 o'clock, somewhere in there. And found a pattern, which is seems to be something that I kind of struggle with. Um, seems like, for the most part, that's one of the things that holds me back in my fishing. Um, the pattern that we found, we found fish around boat lifts 
um, like the legs, support legs of the boat lifts. And we were able to catch them on moving baits, actually. Um, different points throughout the day as well, which was kind of nice. Um, the moving bait that I was able to catch them all on was a chatterbait. It was the Chatterbait Elite Evo, which is the newest one that was just released, I, I believe, about a year or so ago. Maybe not even quite that long ago. Um, and it was a pretty good day. We were able to kind of run that pattern, different areas of the lake, and catch fish that way. The other couple fish that I caught, I caught a really, really tiny crappie. Um, probably four or five inches long that was on a jig head minnow that was a um, dirty jigs guppy head with a six inch juggle minnow and then the later in the day um, that crappie that was the first thing in the morning later in the day I went out and fished some main lake points to try to catch fish this is an area that just seems to hold fish um, all summer long it seems like and ended up uh there was fish kind of busting i ended up casting out towards that uh, kind of open water and i was throwing a, the the same guppy head but i was using a crush city freeloader on that I was able to hook into a fish and um it ended up spitting the lure as it jumped um but other than that pretty much everything else was done um with a chatterbait um seemed to catch fish that way um and it, once I start catching fish like that, I don't like to put that down just because it's so much fun. Uh, the other thing that I wanted to mention, I know I didn't do a whole lot of talking during this video, but uh, kind of like what was going on and stuff. Um, the boat lift pattern that I got on, um, it's a pattern that I also found towards the end of last summer. It seems like those fish that stay shallow, um, they tend to stay around um, cover in the summertime on this particular lake. And as they're up shallow, um, they tend to hang around boat lifts, boat docks, things like that, just because it um, has shade on it. And so that's a pattern that hopefully I'll be able to repeat all summer long. So just wanted to mention that as well. So if you enjoyed the video, um, please like, comment, subscribe, and thanks for watching, guys.